Back now with actor Peter Krause. He stars in Shonda Rhimes' brand new ABC drama, The Catch. It's a high stakes show that pits an elite con man against LA's top private investigator, who just happens to be his fiance. Take a look. What do you think? Will I know? Why I lost control of my heart and soul? I think. You should take it off. I had a chance to see the first episode. This is going to be awesome. We got Peter Krauser here with us live. Thank you so much for joining us. Uh, you bet. Executive produced by Shonda Rhimes. And you yep. said this kind of reminds you of a Roger Moore era James Bond film with a little bit of that yeah. Shonda. He's a thief magic instead of a <laughs> That's right. special agent, you know. But <laughs> uh, yeah, it, it is kind of like that. It's got a little bit of a wink to it. Um, it's meant to be a lot of fun. So it's pure entertainment. And you're playing a con man who fleeces. Yes his fiance for literally millions of dollars to find fleece, and yeah, then you completely exactly. disappear. So, uh, so yeah. what, what drew you to this role? Uh, well, it was very different from parenthood. Um, <laughs> this, is not, this is not necessarily wholesome entertainment to watch with your kids. It's a lot racier than I thought it was gonna mm. be. Uh, I spent a little more time with my clothes off than I thought I would. <laughs> um, a lot of women in America are very happy but, about that. But I, want, I, but I wanted to do something very different from parenthood. And, and this certainly is. It certainly is that. Yeah. Of course, your fiance is one of LA's top private investigators. Yep. And this shows kind of this sexy tango back and forth yeah. between you two. And she is going to stop at nothing to bring you down. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about bring me down, but uh, maybe stop at nothing to get me back, hopefully. Because it's sort of an epic romance in the, in the center of the show. And then you've got these two, sh really, it's two shows smashed together. You've got the investigative unit, then you've got the, the group of con artists. And they overlap because of the relationship between Alice and Ben. And it's been about 10 years since the finale of the highly acclaimed Six Feet Under, where you played the mortician, Nate Fisher. We actually got a clip of that oh, yeah? finale. We're going to show it to you right now. Check it out. Oh, boy. I'm going to miss you. I'm going in. Oh, God, you. I'm going to miss you so much. Nate, don't be stupid. Stupid? Stupid? This is what we came here to do. Come on, bro. You and me. There could be sharks. So you've been taking your shirt off a long yeah. time on well, TV I wanna, now. <laughs> i got to tell you something about that scene. Is they wanted me to do that uh, nude. Uh, uh. And I said, I'm not going to run. <laughs> I don't know if you saw that clip. But like, that's a long way. And I'm like, I'm not going to be running out there with no clothes on, jumping in the ocean. Some people have said that that's one of the most epic finales of all time. What was no. it like for you working on that show? Uh, I loved it. It was five great years. And when I read the pilot, I thought this is going to be something really special. And then it was an amazing five You've years. had a lot of success on camera, but also off. Lauren Graham, a long time yep. girlfriend of yours, you've had a yep. long relationship with. What is the secret? To having success in a relationship uh, in Hollywood? She is great. Um, you know, we keep things pretty private. I will say that on my flight here from LA, I was happy to see on direct TV they were playing Gilmore Girls, so I actually sat on the plane <laughs> watching Gilmore Girls on my way. I know. Right? <laughs> so you're getting a lot of uh, eyes uh, in the background here uh, as well. But people are crazy for that show. Yeah. Um, you know, and Netflix is making four uh, movies of Gilmore Girls. And Dad of the Year candidate as well. You've got a 14 year old son, Roman. Yeah. You played a father uh, figure in a lot of your other roles, yep. but you you coached one of his sports teams? Uh, his baseball team. He's a great kid. He recently uh, decided he was home alone and uh, isn't a haircut not unlike yours, actually. <laughs> Bryce Harper. Really? Yeah, this is similar. Tough. This similar. takes time. But he decided he was going to go for it himself. Ah. And he took a big gouge out of the, you know, not his head, but his hair. And so I got a phone call, Dad, when you get up here, you got to fix it. <laughs> Dude, I'm not a I'm barber. I'm not a barber. <laughs> not you know? a barber. But I took out some clippers and I shaped a little bit. Anyway, we got him to L.A. And it was when we were filming the Tango promo. Uh -huh. And I had the guy at uh, work who does my hair, cut my kid's hair. Yeah. And, all, all day long. Yeah. So Thank you so much you for bet. being here, Peter Krause. This is The Catch. It's premiering tomorrow night, 10 o'clock, 9 central, right here on ABC. We'll be right back. I love you, Peter! <laughs> hey, Robin, how are you?